Yo, what's good, everybody on YouTube, man? It's your boy, P.M. Kicks, man. I am back <clears throat> with another unboxing for y'all today, man. But before we get into this unboxing, y'all already know what to do. Hit that thumbs up button. If you like the content, man, share the video, friends, family, gang, gang, gang members. Hit that notification bell so you won't miss another video. Still review, unboxing, whatever I do. And subscribe, subscribe, subscribe to join the Playmaker gang, 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 man. I know I still sound kind of bad, but I feel a whole lot better, though. So I know it's going away. And um, this unboxing ain't a regular unboxing. It's not a sneaker unboxing, but it is for sneakers, though. So, this out of box look is huge, but it's light. It's huge, but light. And this was something that was much needed. Was much needed, but it still is, though. You know, go out of town, take them trips. You'll need something like this. Oh, how does this open? Okay, I'm just gonna open it the stupid long way, just so I can just pop out. Woo. Knife almost slipped on me, dog. Uh oh. There we go. Okay, it's up. Let me put this up. The receipt. Yeah, man. And, um. Oh, what is this? What is this? And we have. Bow. Yes, man. You see it right there. So. Premise. I'm gonna have to go in here and put that sticker. I'm gonna put this sticker back here because it's definitely going up on the um on the glass. And man, yes, we have our first Soul Premise bag, and I want to say this is the original bag, which is like the nylon cloth material type bag. And let me get this joint open, man. Unboxing turned into a unbagging, and oh yeah, baby, we live. Man, got the little strap right there. And bow, we have, as you can see right here, that SP. We have the Soul Premise bag, man. They got the Soul Premise tag. We don't just secure the bag, we secure the shoes. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I like that slogan right there. Let me see how this joint look on me, first of all. Ugh. Try this joint on. Uh, oh yeah, baby, we live. Yeah, got that soul primitive joint on, man. Got the drum. Hold on, hold on. Let me tighten this. Let me tighten this joint up. Oh yeah. I like this. But let's let's get into the bag, man. Let me let me stop admiring the bag. Let me get straight into it. You got an SP right here, soul premise. You have some little slots right here. I don't know for like cords or whatever same right here you got some little slots down there and we coming into the first I don't know it depends on where you what you want to put down here you can put a pair of shoes down here you can put some clothes down here it all depends on what you want to put at the bottom right here so you have a slot at the bottom this looks big enough where you can actually put like some clothes the layer at the bottom pair of shoes in the middle preferably a DS pair you know you don't want to mess up your clothes shoes in the middle then another pair like another another outfit or something you know securing your shoes again but yeah this right here a lot of space I'm probably gonna do a little demonstration on all this when I get done doing this little review of the bag but yeah man that's right that right there Definitely dope deep pockets. And we opening up the first layer of the bag. I'm trying to sweat the rest of this cold out. Bear with me. You have a little slot right here for, I don't know, toothbrush, you know, some stuff that you need to take on your trip. Whatever you need to take on your trip, you got a slot right there for it. As well as right here, more stuff, deodorant, cologne, whatever. And this is where the shoes come in at. Wow. 
You have a shoe slot up here, a divider right there. So you put one pair of shoes in there, zip it up. The divider is holding the shoe, and you put another pair down here. You zip that up. That's two pairs already. Zip this back up. You go into the next compartment right here. And this right here, you have for uh, your laptop. Throw your laptop in there, all your laptop essentials, your power cords and all that stuff you want to put up in here. You can actually put a, this pocket right here is deep. Okay, you can actually put, you can actually put some clothes in there to kill your laptop so stuff won't be banging up all up in here so you can slide some clothes and stuff that you need down here. You got power cords and stuff for your laptop and that one. And for the third section of your bag, this is where the other two pair of shoes come in. Right here, you have the top one again. Put a pair of shoes. You have that divider right there again. Oh yeah, baby, we live. You have another one right here as well. Pair of shoes, divider. It's another little divider cup down here at the bottom. And again, man, you got right here more. More little compartments and stuff. You can throw an outfit in there. Pair of jeans, shirts, socks or whatever. You hop on your trip, man. You on your way. And yeah. And this thing right here definitely fit comfortable, man. I ain't gonna lie, a lot of cushioning. A lot of cushioning in the back, a lot of padding. This right here also have like a little soft little cushion so all the stuff you put in there won't weigh too heavy on your shoulders. Got a nice little cushioning right there. You have the strap. Make sure everything's secured and locked down inside of you. I mean, while it's on you, just uh. Click that right there, tighten up to your to your liking. You feel me? And yeah, man, this is this is fire. Now, now I'm mad that I didn't grab the leather one, but you know, this would definitely hold me. I like the I like the level stuff off. You know, you start at the bottom, then you work your way up. So that's basically what I'm doing, man. And unbreakable code. <sighs> Definitely knock some knock some um, money off of here. So definitely use unbreakable code. I think Mike Rich got one as well. So use Mike Rich code, use unbreakable code, whichever one you want to use, you know that's up to you. But yeah, man, this is definitely fire. Now let me give you a demonstration on how to put the shoes, or not necessarily how to put the shoes, or can the shoes actually fit in there. So let's get straight into it. Okay, let's get into it, man. I picked out some shoes that I want to see can fit in here and they say it's, I think it fits up to a size like 13 or something I, I don't know I didn't I forgot what what it said but I don't want to do all slim skinny shoes I picked the shoes they all in the back so we're gonna start out with these big boys right here we're gonna start out with these big boys right here man these are these is a size 9 I wear a size 9 so Oh man. Oh no. They ain't they ain't for big shoes. Apparently. This is not for big shoes. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, I gotta stuff this in here. Oh no, they ain't for this. Hold up. I don't know, is that um it looks, it looks like it might be making it. It's on there. It's in there. Uh, see, with traveling, you're going to have to do your shoes kind of like this, but you're going to have to, like, know how to make everything work like this. So, with that, I will be putting the clay Yeezys on the other end. I wouldn't put two bulky shoes in the same pack. I wouldn't be rocking two bulky shoes on vacation anyway. But I want to make this video a little bit, you know, just in case people rock that stuff. So hold on, let me squeeze these in here. Wow, there you go, man. You got these big boys in there. 
Got these little boys down here. I don't know what size this fit up to, but my nine, my size nine is touching here to here. So, I don't know. Did I put my size on there? Mm -hmm. I don't think so. I just bought the bag, but I don't know. Let's go to the next compartment for the shoes, which is here. And for this, I'm putting in the sand fours. So hold on, let me squeeze these in here. Wow, ah, man, the fours went in there pretty good. Still got my stock X hang tag on there. But the fours went in pretty good. Fours was no, no struggle. They went in pretty good. And for my last, well, not my last pair of shoes, but the next pair of shoes, hmm. I'm going to put in the Blue Moon Jordan 1. They came out with that pack of four from last year. So, I'm going to put these joints in there real quick. Hold on, let me squeeze these in here too. Wow, there you go, man. This side was pretty easy. You know, it wasn't too much of a struggle getting this side in, but that first side was, that was some shit right there. Four pair of shoes in, weight-wise, it ain't bad. Ain't bad, but this is without clothes and laptops and all that stuff. This is just four pair of shoes. Weight still ain't bad though, so hold on. Let me put the fifth pair of shoes in. And I'm guessing that goes at the bottom. And for the fifth pair, I'm gonna go with foam posit going fishing joint. So give me a minute, let me put these in there. Wow man, there you go. Fifth pair of shoes in there. It's at the bottom of the bag and it's still like a lot of room back here. Like, I think at the bottom, if you want to, you can put like two pair of Yeezys at the bottom of your shoe. Yeezys are real flexible. They flimsy, they're kind of flexible, soft. So they got a lot of room. They can bend and, and, and do a whole bunch of stuff. So yeah, man, weight wise on this, eh, it ain't bad, you know. I ain't no like super skinny dude, so, but. You know, it ain't bad, the um, straps providing that cushion. So, yeah, there you go, man. Five pair of shoes in here. Now, what size they hold up to, I don't know. I'm not sure. My size nine. And these, my size nines is really touching wall, like, kind of, almost kind of like wall to wall. So, I don't know the size they go up to with the shoes. And then my big boys, man, it's touching wall, roof, but they in there, man. They literally touching the top, the bottom, the sides, and this is a size, this is a size eight and a half, but I'm guessing they run, these are Converse, the Just Dawn Converse. I guess they run a little bit bigger. You know, Converse do run big, but yeah. These are that, and I still have a lot of room. You know, I could put certain stuff in this flap right here. And then if you open it up on this side, you know, I can still put stuff in here, stuff in here. And then if you open it up on the other side, this side right here, which is for the laptop, the laptop cords, it's still a deep bag down here where you can put clothes and stuff to get in front of the laptop so it won't be banging around stuff like this. So this right here goes all the way up to here. So I can still pile this section up with clothes. So yeah, that right there is my little review on the sole premise bag. Like I said, I'm a size eight and a half to nine and a half. And my shoes fit in here. You know, it does the trick. I can't wait to go on a vacation so I can use this bag on there. You know, vacation coming real soon. And uh, shout out Soul Premise, man. Use Unbreakable Kicks code. I think it's Unbreakable or Mike Rich code. I don't really know what Mike Rich code is. But yeah, man, I think it's just Mike Rich or 
I think so. But anyways, man, make sure you hit that thumbs up button if you like the content, man. Share the video, friends, family, gang, gang, gang members. Hit that notification bell so you won't miss another video. Still review, unboxing, slash unbagging, review, whatever I do. And subscribe, subscribe, subscribe to join the Playmaker gang, 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 man. So, premise bag, five pair of shoes in here right now. And we out this gym.